Hello everyone, welcome to the Daily Nature Journal. So for the first half of this video I'm back at Seaton Wetlands and I'm going to be feeding the birds, showing you a few of the sights in the, on the lagoon for the waders and the seabirds and then I'm going to go back to the studio and use some of those observations and, and videos of the birds to put another nice sketch into my regular journal. So this is one of the hides and it's right in the middle of the lagoon so it's a really good place to come and watch the birds here. So there were some lapwings on the island in the middle today. There's a lot of sounds of lapwings and gulls all around. But it's very windy in the hide today so it's actually a lot more sheltered out on the paths. All right, so back in the studio the next day and I've been doing these little sketches of the blackbird that we saw in the earlier clip and I'm just using stills from the video to try and get the shape of the bird and the way that the face looks and get some of his little character because he was quite happy to just kind of sit close by and he wouldn't quite feed from the hand but he was getting close. Now I really want to put this bird now into my my journal and I think I can do some of these nice little head sketches up here to finish off the page from the last video. So based on these sketches let's get started. So I'm starting out by just taking a couple of my favourite sketches and my favourite pictures and just trying out where I might like to put them. I actually quite like this design so then I go in with my fine liner. This time I'm using a Derwent line maker in 01 size for this work. I really like the soft brown lines of this marker. Now today I'm using a purple and an indigo and a green from Bohemian Raspberries Botanical Inks range. I'm also using my own Willow ink and my own Coltsfoot ink and a little splash here and there of Derwent ink tents. I'm just adding some dark behind the blackbird to bring him forward a little bit. And as usual with these sketches I'm not getting carried away with detail too much neither in terms of the painting or the lines but I'd quite like to kind of fill this out so that the whole page is full of colour. So I think I'm quite happy with this, it's made a, a nice page and finished this one off and I think it's a fitting tribute to my day out yesterday sketching the birds. If you want to see more tutorials from me check out my Patreon and please do subscribe to the channel to see more of this sort of content. Thanks so much for watching and I'll see you next time.